Here's a point layer that I'm working with, but the symbols are so boring. What if I wanted to upload my own symbol instead of being stuck with some of these? You can totally do that. Click the file button and navigate to whatever SVG or PNG you want. Here's a windmill SVG that I like. I'll make it bigger. Looks like this. By default, it's white, but because it's white, I can tint it whatever color I like, like this. All right, now we're talking, but check this out. I can go into the structure, duplicate this, and for the bottom most version, give it a semi-transparent black color and rotate it. And reposition it. Now my point icons have little shadows, which is cute. Check this out, we can go even further. Instead of a solid shadow, we can make it fade. We'll dig into this, and rather than a solid fill, let's give it a gradient fill of semi-transparent black to fully transparent black. We'll choose linear, continuous. Now I've got a cool faded shadow effect, super easy.